Pond hockey and ice golf were just two of the activities taking place at Breezy Point Resort's 24th annual Ice Fest this past weekend. Our Anthony Scott was also at Ice Fest and has more on the story. Love if you're in Minnesota, weather. you have to do this. You, you have you to embrace the weather and you, you just embrace it, baby, it. and you have fun. It was that kind of electric energy that filled the ice on Pelican Lake over the weekend for Breezy Point Resorts Ice Fest. Thanks to the weather being about 40 degrees, people came from all over to take part in the festivities on Saturday. There's uh, lots of families and, and lots of groups of friends that just always are here year after year for this event. It's just something fun for, for them to do and, and get out in the winter. One of the main events at Ice Fest is the Pond Hockey Tournament, featuring teams of all ages and skill levels. Well, for us boys, I, I think during the winter, uh, playing hockey is probably the biggest thing that we do. I mean, like you see it here on a Saturday afternoon, Saturday evening, we're out here playing hockey when we could be going doing something else. Hockey is just a big part, of our, uh, part, big part of what we do here. But Pond Hockey was just a small part of the festivities. At Breezy Points Ice Fest, woo! There really is something for everybody. The ice slide has been a huge hit today with all the kids and uh, the uh, bonfires going down there and there's s'mores and uh, roasting sticks and stuff down there for people to, to partake in. So There was also a beanbag tournament, ice golf, live music at night, and horse rides throughout the day. Some of the food purchased at the event also went to support the Pillager Trap shooting team. Breezy Point supports us very well. They've donated the food and uh, we take all the profits. So it's going to work out really well. We'll make some money and, and that'll, that'll help the whole team out. Later in the evening, live music and fireworks concluded Saturday's ice festival. This is for everybody. I mean, I've seen kids here that are four years old. I've seen people here that are 84 years old. You know, we're having a lot of fun out here. If you come here, you will find something to do. You're going to meet new people and have a lot of fun. Over its 24-year history, Ice Fest has become the thing to do in Breezy Point the weekend after New Year's. Reporting from Ice Fest! In Breezy Point, Anthony Scott, Lakeland News. Ice Fest always falls on the first weekend after New Year's, and Breezy Point Resort says they will be back for their 25th festival next year. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.